everybody. I'm sure it's a pretty trying time for everybody out there with the lockdown throughout the country. Of course, our government is doing a lot of things. I'm sure um, you've been reading about the different um, things that the government is doing to ease the burden for people. There have been some announcements by RBI as well. And I will be covering most of these announcements in my monthly update. Well, continuing to talk about contingency planning, today I'm going to be speaking in RIN Talks, my 12th vlog on non-life insurance other than medical insurance. Um, welcome to Mrin Talks, my vlog, where I take you through the steps of investing. We have spoken about budgeting, expense management, why you need to first save for contingencies through the emergency fund, life insurance, medical insurance. And today on the final part of contingency planning, we are talking about non uh, medical general insurance like car insurance, home insurance and travel insurance. Starting off with car insurance, I'm sure it's something that all of you know about. But just remember that in the car insurance, you have an option to take the zero depreciation cover. It is a good idea to take this cover. What it really says is that when you buy a car insurance and if you make a claim, then without really depreciating or without really reducing any amount, the whole amount will get covered, all right? So they will not deduct the amount on any of the parts and stuff like that. Coming to travel insurance, I know all of you might be thinking travel insurance, who's gonna be traveling anywhere probably for the next few months? Well, I'm sure you will, you know, the moment this lockdown gets over and all this coronavirus is behind us, I'm sure all of us are just dying to get out do remember it's important to take the travel insurance which covers us medically. Many of the travel policies also cover loss of baggage. But remember, if it is the fault of the airline and not if it is your fault. So for example, if you miss picking up your baggage from the airport, it's, it's your fault and that is not going to be covered. Do take a good amount of medical cover. These policies again can be bought online. They're pretty cheap. You can ensure the entire family at one go in one policy. A very important cover that is often neglected is the home insurance. Now home insurance basically covers your house, which is the building structure and the contents against fire or um, as far as the contents are concerned against theft and burglary, right? You can take a single cover, which basically covers your house and as well as the contents of your house there are various add-on covers available in case, you know, in the case where, let's say, there's been a natural calamity and the house needs to be reconstructed, then essentially the insurance will pay your rent also during the period when your house is getting reconstructed. Now, the maximum amount of cover that you can take under home insurance is 5 crores. As far as building insurance is concerned, it is the premium is calculated built on, based on the built-up area. And it basically includes the superstructures, the doors, the windows, electrical and plumbing. What it does not include is the furniture and the fixtures. So that means, you know, if you have like a dining table or if you've got some fixed furniture, that is not going to be included in the building insurance, right? The tenure that you can take ranges between 1 to 20 years. And remember that home insurance only covers the building cost it does not cover the land cost, right? So hence, it is better to buy the home building insurance on a reinstatement basis, which means that this is the value of reconstructing the house and depreciation would not be deducted. Remember, let's say your house is for 1 crore right now and you're buying a 1 crore cover. And let's say you have an issue maybe 10 years down the line or you have a claim on building insurance 5 years down the line. Remember, due to insurance, the value of reconstructing the property would go up. And hence, it is very important to buy home insurance on a reinstatement basis. Now, um, the fire insurance basically covers the building and, and the content uh, against 12 perils, which is basically fire, lightning, storm, flood, earthquakes. And nowadays, even terrorism is available as an additional cover. 
The things that are not included in the cover are depreciation or wear and tear, loss of cash in case if the damage has been caused by war or if the damage has been caused by a mechanical or an electrical breakdown. So for example, if there's a fire due to an electrical breakdown, that may not be covered. Now, um, please do remember that in case you take the policy and if you decide to cancel it before one year, you can lose between 25 to 75% of the premium. And the so we, all this while we spoke about the building insurance. Now I'm going to talk about the content insurance, which covers the contents in your house, like the furniture, the fixtures, your gadgets, jewelry, etc. Against um, loss due to theft, fire, flood or other mishaps. Of course, not mishaps done by you purposefully. Um, and as I mentioned, jewelry has to be valued. Some of the policies might have some type of sublimits to say that a particular item cannot be uh, having more than 25% of the overall cover. So for example, if you're taking a cover of 50 lakhs, it may not allow you to cover out of that 40 lakhs for jewelry alone. Um, if you do have a large amount of jewelry that you want to get covered, I think that you should look at a standalone jewelry cover. So really summing up, um, of course, there are many other types of insurance available. Like nowadays, you have phone insurance available. You have marriage insurance available. So in case if you have a very high marriage expenditure and right now, for example, if you had a situation where that we are in now where there's a lockdown and your marriage has to be canceled, in those cases, the uh, marriage cover is quite useful because it really pay, pays you for the loss incurred due to cancellation of your marriage. Of course, it does not include loss incurred if you decided to cancel your marriage on your own. So there are many different types of insurance covers available. We tend to go with life, medical and car insurance, but do consider even travel insurance is very popular now. I think one of the covers that is really truly missed out is the home cover. It's very cheap again, mostly you can buy it online. Um, of course, other than if you're buying a jewelry cover, the building insurance, for example, can be bought for 10 years online at one go. So do consider some of these covers. And I hope you've been enjoying Rin Talks. Do write into us and let us know if there's something specific that you want me to cover. Please click on the bell icon to subscribe and do tell others about our vlogs as well. It's a good time for you to actually figure out how you can plan your finances better. If you don't have home insurance, do read up on it. Do look at buying it online. You don't need to go anywhere to buy it. Till then, bye-bye.